11.05. I woke up. Well, actually, I woke up early. I went to sleep early, so I slept for a long time. I slept for like 10 hours, so now I'm fully energized and rested. It's 11.06, and I just got done from filming a TikTok. Well, I started filming a TikTok on doing my hair, like a, a hair tutorial, a braid tutorial on uh, the Knotless Jumbo braid that I be wearing. So I started it. I didn't finish. I'm waiting on my hair to dry. But in the meantime, I have a whole bunch of other stuff that I need to be doing. So. I'm going to pause that and then once my hair dry and I finish doing what I need to do, then I'll get back to that. But, um, so yeah, I need to be cleaning this room because it's a mess. What y'all, what y'all doing? What y'all doing this weekend? I don't have a whole bunch of stuff planned for this weekend because this weekend I just wanted to, like, chill and let everything go however it goes because we didn't have any plans the last two weekends. The last two weekends we've been going to a kids' parties. Last weekend we went to... My little cousin party, he turned one. The weekend before that was my nephew's birthday party. He turned three. Um, we went to the dog park. So we've been doing like a lot of kitty stuff. And I've been enjoying herself. So this weekend, I didn't want to do nothing because I was tired as hell. I think between like the last, within the last week, I probably got like maybe 12 hours of sleep. So your girl was tired. And I ain't trying to even see no kids this weekend. So Nala is going to her nanny's house for the weekend. And I need to be doing some cleaning because oh, this room is it's a mess. So I need to be cleaning that up. We don't have no real plans for the weekend, but I'm pretty sure we're gonna do out, go out and sorry, we'll go out and hang out for a minute, do something fun. Oh, I know I am. So yeah, I'm just checking in with y'all. So we're gonna do like a little weekend vlog thing, and I need to run a few errands. So once I get back, so yesterday I went. To, I was supposed to start this on yesterday. But yesterday it was just crazy. It didn't go how I planned on it going. So I really didn't have time. But I did go to um, Home Goods and what else did I do? Oh, I went to Ulta. So once I get back, I'll show y'all the stuff that I got for Ulta. In the meantime, I need to be cleaning this from child because it's ridiculous. So I'm finally out and about. I just um, actually I'm still sitting in front of my door. I just threw some clothes on. I even clothes just like some leggings and a t-shirt. Um, so like, yeah, like I was telling y'all inside, um, like these last few weekends, we have been running, just like running, 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 no rest, just running off of little to no rest. Like, um, so the weekends we pretty have it. During the week is just like work, 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 work. Like I always tell y'all. So it's like, we don't get um, hardly no rest during the week. And then it's kind of like when a weekend come, we want to either like get some rest or just like try to find something fun to do. Um, catch up on house chores, all of that good stuff. It's just like, it's just not enough time in a day, in a week, in a month, in a year. So, um, we've been running, 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 and I, I do work um, during the day, and I work overnight now, so I've been getting home at about like maybe 4.30, 4 o'clock sometimes. By the time I get in bed, it's 5 o'clock or almost 5 o'clock, so I have to get up at 6.30 to get Nala ready for school, so that's like two and a half hours of sleep in between. And once I get up to get Nala ready for school, it's kind of like, okay, I come back and it's time to start the day. Boom, ain't no um, getting back in bed or none of that. So it's kind of like this last week to two weeks, I've been running off of like maybe three hours of sleep a night. So your girl beat wore down this week. And it's just like, I didn't feel like um, being obligated on a weekend to, uh, to go to nothing, to, to do, if I wanted to sleep in on a weekend, this weekend, I wanted to do that. So I didn't want to be obligated to do nothing. Like I said, these last two weekends, we've been running back and forth with Nala to different parties and stuff, um, which was cool because she got a chance to enjoy herself. And it's just like, we couldn't miss those parties. So I also have another party to go to next weekend. My godson um, is having a party next Saturday. So we'll be going to that as well. But this weekend, we just really needed a break because it's been, listen, y'all, it's been rough as hell just like running off of 
the Lord's, I don't know, running off, we in a prayer, like they say, that's what we've been running off, like, I haven't been really getting no sleep, and I'm not really complaining, but I am tired, so just like this weekend, I don't even want to see a kid, not even my own kid. So she's gone, so um, like I told you, I just got done filming the TikTok, I started filming the TikTok, we got up, we got up maybe like 8.30 this morning, but we went to bed early because both of us was tired, like Johnny worked a lot too, so it's just like, we were beat down, like, Johnny hardly, hardly ever goes to bed real early, um, and like I said, I'm usually working overnight, so it's just like, last night, we both conked out, like, we both conked out, we slept for like 10 hours which was good so I'm feeling better um I'm a busy body so I usually can't keep still so he was just telling me just now nah, won't you just rest and, and I'm like oh I did rest I got like 10 hours of sleep that's enough rest I haven't had that kind of rest in probably since I was a child so he's still inside resting which is cool so I'm about to be out and about I think I want to go wash my car I'm not sure what we're getting into today but we will be doing something i'm not sure what it is i also have an unboxing i need to do um for y'all i'll show y'all that some amazon stuff i got i need to redo i really redo it but just like reorganize the desk that space in our room because we have like a we have a desktop um computer like little i guess office corner in a room and i got some stuff from amazon so i need to do that over um won't take me long uh, and like I said, I'm not, we don't, I didn't really make no plans for this weekend because I didn't want to be obligated to do nothing. Whatever happens, just happens. So I think we're going to go ahead on and get this car washed. And I'm not sure after that, but I'll catch up with y'all later. <laughs> So I'm done running my errands for today. At least um I didn't run all the errands that I'm gonna run. Whatever didn't get done, it won't get done. I didn't honestly. I didn't really do a whole bunch. I didn't really record because I was like in and out, in and out, in and out, and it wasn't like much to record. It wasn't nothing fun, so I didn't really record. I also did not wash my car, but um I'm headed home now. I asked Johnny if he wants to eat some crawfish and a daiquiri, or either crawfish and a snowball, and he was down for it. So I'm on my way home, and I'll check back in with y'all in a few. Alright y'all, so we about to play smash or pass, smash or pass while we finish smashing these crawfish though. So. so I have to, we have Johnny over here. So smash or pass, so I have to, I'll go first. I'm going to ask you smash or pass, I'm going to give a name. And if you, if you pass, you got to tell me why you passed, a reason why you passed. And if you smash, you just smash. And then you go, I go, you go. Alright, so. Um. Smash up ass, Jada Pinkett. <laughs> I can't stand up. Okay. So pass? Mm -hmm. Why you pass? I can't stand up. To you. To you, be No go. Smash up ass, Chris Rock. <laughs> I'm fucking <laughs> pass. I will pass, pass. No, pass. It's, why. It's, it's plenty of reasons. <laughs> the, the, the most recent reason? You got smacked. Not only did you get smacked, that's fine because you can't control what people do. You didn't even act like you was gonna do nothing. No kind of. If you can't protect yourself, you ain't gonna protect me. 
Mm-mm. I ain't getting my goodies. All right. Um, make the stallion. Pass. Pass. Y'all heard that? Not interested Why? at all. Why? Never have been. She sound like me. She sound like a dude? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Smash your pass, Drake. Drake. Pass. I ain't, ain't even got to think about that. Drake, Drake. I have plenty of reasons. Um, off the top of my head, main reason is he's very light skinned. And I'm not attracted to light skin. <laughs> no discrimination against light, light skin. It's just my one reason why I will pass on Drake. And a lot of the stuff you do is just like, mm, Suspect. Um, Sierra. Pass. Can't stand how you pass, man. Why would you pass on Sierra? I would smash she, Sierra. She next to uh, what's her name? Jada Pinkett. What's wrong? How? Oh, you How is Sierra? You don't know, you know who Sierra is? Who, Sierra, how is she I evil? Never liked Sierra. Why? How is she evil? She Sierra don't bother nobody. How is she evil? She said she evil. How is she evil? She act like Jada Pinkett. Y'all like fake to me. How you say the woman useless? <laughs> useless how? She useless. Like, I don't see. What, what she do? Nothing. Have a damn good man get taken care of. She's a housewife. That's what she do. Before that, she ain't do nothing. So what? Like, what's that guy doing with you? Because she ain't do nothing. I'm saying that. Like, why? Why would I be interested in nothing? She might look good. That's everybody on the internet. See, you boring to play with. That ain't. You going to. She, 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 she's useless. Why is she useless? Cause she don't do not, nothing. She's famous. Who else is it? Oh, smash pass, Jay Z. I know this probably ain't gonna be the move. I'm, I'm a Jay Z got a cool ass demeanor. He do, but I'm gonna have to go ahead on and pass on Jay Z. I'm sorry, Jay, but I will pass on Jay Z. I'm gonna have to pass on Jay Z. Um, like I said, he have a like I like his demeanor. His, he have a cool like he seemed like he a cool ass person. Um. He ain't attractive to me. He ain't attractive. I don't know if he just like, he like bad built skinny. I don't like his hair. I don't like. I don't know what he look like. Yeah, I, I, I don't know what he got going on. I, I'm gonna have to. And I feel some way that he cheats on me, I think. Um, I'm gonna have to go on and pass, pass, pass. Actually, a, a big peak, big pass. You ain't attracted to none of these people. I'm talking about physically, because we don't know them personally. Physically, no. Okay. All right. Gotta take your ass off. Even eat potatoes, what's today? I don't know what's up with them. Well, it tastes like it ain't It's not like, it tastes it. it don't, it's not like seasoned like it used to be, and a, maybe they overcooked or something. I don't know. They soft? Yeah, they soft and they usually be. Smash it past Rick Ross. There you go. Mm -mm. Pass. Pass, pass, pass. I don't like nothing about Rick Ross. And that's my reason. Like, it's easier for me to say what I don't, I don't like nothing about nothing. I didn't end up. His voice when he rap is okay, but pass. I don't like nothing about him. Um, see, we gotta get you. You weird, I don't know. Uh, Y'all, I gotta pick Instagram women for him. This tastes like that's what he like. He always smiling because that's what he like. No. He like Instagram women. He don't like. This tastes like He like big fine big booty bitches on Instagram. Um, let me think of one of their names. Amiradine. 
You can ask Chad and Ashton them though. Okay. I just know the ones that I, I see in the ones. That's the thing. You like not small but slimmer women. But you going to match see ever? Nah, Man, you I crazy. Like <laughs> Another dick. Tiana Taylor. Maybe a long time ago, but not now. I don't know what she looked like, not for real. Not even Alright. It tastes slimy. Potato. Like yeah, it, it's a weird. Like I could squeeze it and it'll come straight yeah, up. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. It's soft, like it's a weird. Um, you're having issues over that today, I guess. The crop is fine, man. Yeah. Kanye West. I hate Kanye West. I hate Kanye. I hear everything about. Yeah. Other than the fact, and not even now, like he used to could dress. But no, I'm gonna have to pass. Um. Shit, I don't. I don't like. I don't like. The, I don't like his attitude. I, I don't. Work. I mean, as far as like him being attractive, he's not like. He's not ugly or whatever. But he, mm -mm, no, he does not be like. Ooh, damn. Mm -mm. Uh. Let me see. I gotta. I gotta dig deep for you because you tripping. You be. Or either you lying. He lying. One of the. Two. <coughs> um. on the same like all the people you used to say and then the people yeah, I, I, can't stand, I can't stand I can't stand Jennifer Lopez Ain't Jennifer no Lopez was cool you don't like and then she don't want to be black when it's time to go to jail she Puerto Rican fuck up okay she on the same with all the other people I never did like Jennifer Lopez she was cool when she was what's the name of that show living single when she was dancing in the background that's your reason that's your reason Puffy. Puffy. I'm gonna smash Puffy. I'm gonna go ahead and smash him. I ain't gonna even lie to you. Puffy. I love his demeanor. Um, but then again, I might have to pass because I think he's bisexual. So when I throw that in there, I might pass on Puffy. I forgot about that. I think he I think he is very bisexual. I think he liked the idea of having like beautiful women. He didn't had a bunch of beautiful women. He never been married. He didn't been with all these different women. I think he bisexual. I'm a pass. If, if if that wasn't one of the factors, I would smash. But mm, puppy, you want a man? I can't do it. I can't be a man and give you what a man could give you. Um, but he a cool dude from what I see. Uh. Like Nala. No. Man. Come on. I'm not now. serious. How old is this chick? I don't know. I never even looked up. How old is she? But she looks like she about out to go to jail. Fuck. Okay. That's it. Fuck Oprah. Because <laughs> at this point, I don't know. <laughs> you'll probably you'll smash Oprah, huh? No. Nah, <laughs> you, no. You'll smash TD. I'm sending the Reg and uh, Mark. You'll smash TD. Come on now. Reg and Mark together. Because I, I got to try to figure Because the ones I'm throwing out. The good ones, I feel like it's the good ones. You talking about passing. Alright. I'm on my if. At the top. Mm -mm. Mm -hmm. I think I might be done. Alright, I got a good one. Bernie's Burgos. Boy, get the fuck out of here. You fucking lying. You lying. You you, you sat here lied the whole time. Nah, 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 I was testing you. You lied. You sat here and lied the whole time. Every one of them women you would have smashed. You sat here and lied. Now, you I, don't trust, now I don't trust you. I'm lying. telling you. Though. You wouldn't smash Bernice. Man, you lying. Not no more. Like Boy, you lying through that no, fucking head. <laughs> you just lying. Like I, ain't, I said smash. I ain't say make her your wife. I said smash her. Smash it. Drunk Tuesday. There you go, whatever. No. Okay. 
Okay. You gotta believe it because you said it, but. You gonna wash this off? You didn't look at my shirt. I feel like I look like Nala. You don't have nothing on your shirt. Yo, this man lying. <laughs> what you say? He's lying. He's lying. He's lying his ass off. Ain't no way. Huh? Ain't no way. Now, why this man, why nobody told me my little paper was sliding off the back of my, my head? You think he would have told me? That's how I know he's lying. Because a liar ain't going to tell you your, your hair messed up or whatever. This man was sitting here lying. But no, y'all, half of them women, I named some beautiful women. And ain't no way. Maybe he just don't want to tell me. You know? But I know. That some of them uh, names I named should have been a smash. Okay. And I'm a woman. And that's coming from a, a woman saying that. So. and the sun is starting to go down and your girl is cold. I forgot my jacket. I usually bring me a jacket out here but I didn't bring one so we just finished our crawfish and we're gonna head on out. We might stop at Sam's and um I might stop at Home Goods. He don't know yet but um after that we're gonna go home and figure everything out later. We may get out tonight. Uh I'm not sure. Well I'm getting out tonight for sure. I don't know about him but we're gonna go head on and wrap this up and I will see y'all in a bit. If the world was dead, would you cry or would you try to get me? Tell me now, I want you to be clear. Tell me now, I need you to be clear. We back home, we just made it off of our little field trip, day date. And um, I'm gonna just show y'all what we got. Well, a few things that uh, we got while I was out real quick. We got some stuff from Sam's, I already put it up, some groceries, and I'm not gonna show that. But as y'all seen, we went to Home Goods. My camera did die when we went to, I think my battery died when we went to Home Goods, or Sam's, one of the two, I don't know. But anywho, I got this little um, car seat cover from Home Goods. It's like if you have pets, you put it on your back seat. Um, and I have been bringing them back and forth to the vet, like on play dates and stuff like that. So I have been bringing them out more and having them in my car. So I got this, and also not just for the pets, but for my daughter because I don't know what she be doing in my back seat. I be having like Reese's cereal in my back seat, Capri Pun Sun pouches, like all kinds of stuff. Girl, clean your mess up. So when you got a kid. This this gonna do the job. And dog, so I'ma just leave this in my car at all times just to keep my back seat a little clean. So I try to keep my little car clean, you know what I'm saying? But with home girl, she ain't allowing that. I got this big old um we went to Sam's and we got this big old ginormous dog bed from Sam's. It's really, really heavy and like sturdy. It's really nice. It seems like it's really good quality. It was only $29. Like these type of beds be like $70, $80 to $100. So this was a really good price. I'm going to give this bed to Wendy. Wendy have a bed already. Bentley don't have a bed right now because he tore his bed up. So he's not going to get the new bed. Wendy going to get the new bed and I'm going to give Bentley her bed. So she just got the bed not too long ago. But anywho, he going to learn to stop tearing his shit up. So we got Wendy a new bed. Um, and what else did I got? So I think I told y'all. Yeah, my little thing. I might as well just take this shit off because I gotta finish my hair anyway. Um, I went to Home Goods and CJ Maxx Friday. I didn't record because I forgot my camera, and also I just spent too much time going back and forth, getting Bentley to and from the vet, so I didn't have a chance to record. But I got this um sandalwood and patchouli linen spray. This smells real good. Anything that's gonna keep the house smelling fresh and good, sign me up. Um. I got two new bars of soap we're gonna try. One for me is the Wild Honey. And I got this one for Johnny. It is a uh, goat milk, gentleman soap. So it's goat milk and 
dunk of water. It smells real good. It smells like a grown, sexy ass man. And that's just what he is. So that's what I got for him. Um, what else I got? Oh, I got this from. Oh, I got this from TJ Maxx. Some um, rose water facial toner. I'm going to try this out. See how this works. Uh, I got some jeans for Nyla. I'm not going to show those. Just some regular blue jeans that I just picked up. And I went to Ulta. And I got... Oh, and thanks to my girl, Megan, for putting put me on this. This is the last video I saw with this. I've seen a few videos of um, the Elf Halo Glow Liquid Filter. Y'all check my girl, Megan, out. Her name is... Um, all things Megan on YouTube. I love her channel. She's funny as hell. Um, that's my friend in my head. We never met. But anywho, I'm gonna try this out. Um and also I got some some new lashes. I have like a whole draw of lashes. I have like a whole collection of lashes, but I want to try these. These are real cute and they're supposed to be real comfortable. It's um eco lashes and it's, it has a cotton band on them because sometimes like those lashes I wear contacts so Especially when I go out, I don't wear glasses. I hardly avoid glasses, especially when I go out. I have contacts and sometimes the band, I don't know, it do something to me, it mess with my eyes. So I'm gonna try these out. And what else did I get? I believe, I believe that was it. Um, that was it, I think that's all I got. So yeah, I'm gonna finish putting this stuff up. I need to clean my little, um, room because it's a mess in here. I did my hair and I haven't like during the week I've been real busy like I told y'all so I've been like in and out getting dressed getting stuff putting stuff back not putting stuff back so it's a mess so I'm cleaning this up I might clean it tomorrow I don't know because we're supposed to be going to hang out tonight so um we're gonna go hang out me and my man we're gonna get some um us time because we haven't been having them so we're gonna go hang out I'm not sure where we're going but like I told y'all I, I started filming a TikTok tutorial earlier so I'm gonna finish that now that my hair is dry and we got back from doing all the things we need to do. And I believe that's it. So I'm going to check back with y'all when I start getting dressed. Alright y'all. Took my bath and everything and I did my brows off camera. Because it's just take a bitch all day to do the brows. Okay. And yeah of course I ain't got time tonight. It's 9.27. So I got to get it, get it started. Alright so I showed y'all the new stuff i'm gonna try out tonight it is the elf halo glow liquid filter and i matched it up with this is what i usually wear l'oreal true match in nut brown so this was the show y'all closest thing to it this is a little bit darker but we're gonna figure it out um this is six color six tan. so we're gonna try it out tonight and I don't think this is a um, I don't think this is a full coverage and this is how it comes so instead of using the um, let's just see how This is how it looks. It blends in really smooth. It's like a little bit off. But it'll do. So yeah, I just wanted to test it out. I'm going to on it. Use this and apply it all over. It's really almost the consistency of a, um, I guess like a medium coverage foundation. I don't like that sound. I don't like it too much either, so we gonna go work that in first. So as y'all can see, it's not um it's not matte. It's more on the dewy side. So if you like a uh, matte finish, this probably won't be for you. It's kind of shiny. So I believe if you have a dry skin, this might be perfect, which I do have dry skin. But it blends in so good. 
It's like it just melts into your skin. And it's not it's not really heavy, so this is perfect for tonight because we're not going nowhere spectacular. Um, so I don't want to do like this heavy makeup look. So this is perfect for what we're going. We just going to like a little. We just going to get some drinks. It's kind of like a little hole in the wall type thing. Um, honestly, I I love going to places like that because that's where I have the most fun. Like everybody, not just like bougie and stuck up and just standing around. So listen, if you invite me somewhere, or if you come out with me. And you don't like to be out with nobody that dance, that socialize, that just like, don't, don't, don't invite me. Don't invite me because I'm a dance. I'm a dance. I'm a dance if it's just two people. If it's just me and somebody. If it's just me, I'm a dancing. So, I'm not like the wallflower friend. I'm not going to be like, trying to be cute all night, just standing on the wall. I'm a dance. Especially when my song come out, I'm dancing. So, I ain't, the, I ain't the boring friend. So, if you want somebody that's going to come out and just stand on the wall, Look cute, look around. Name me. Don't, don't, don't even invite me because I, I ain't gonna do that. As a matter of fact, you just leave me here because I'm, I'm a dance. I hate going out and just like standing on the wall. Everybody just standing around. Nobody wanna move. Everybody trying to be cute. Baby, look. I'm gonna be cute, but I'm a dance. Okay. I'm a dance. I'm having me a good old time. I'm gonna do that. So yeah, like I was saying, I, I, ain't, I ain't that friend. So if you're looking for somebody that's just like, you know, quiet and cute and just wanna, baby, I'm gonna dance. I'm gonna have me a few drinks and I'm gonna enjoy myself, so. Even like, even um like as far as I'm not I'm not the like I'm not uppity I'm not the stuck up girl trying to be cute I like I that don't speak don't talk want to be mean like I'm sorry y'all keep looking over here um want to be mean like that's not me that's really not me like I'm super friendly especially when I drink I'm super friendly probably too friendly but yeah that's not even like as far as like restaurants go and like just dates and stuff like that like I'm not bougie like i like a good restaurant every now and then like a good steak yeah it's cool every now and then but baby don't bring me nowhere where they gonna serve me a plate of decorations with greens and leaves and flowers and i don't want that i want some food i want to eat i want to really eat i want to get full I, I don't it's cute and all but i want to eat bring me somewhere where i can eat where i'm gonna be full where i don't have to have five different plates for me to get kind of full baby i want to eat Okay, no, that that's cute and that's fine and all of that, but I, I don't have to have all of that. All of it. Like I said, I like, you know, every woman wants to be wine and nine every now and then, but you don't have to bring me to those places all the time. Like, you know, for people that's just on a, you know, getting to know each other, maybe on a first little date or whatever. Yeah, you know, and I still feel like that's like a, impre like, let me impress her type of thing. But if you can't keep that up. Because I feel like that's tricking somebody. Like you start start off one way and the next thing you know it's like Well you know I can't really um afford to do this, right? Or you know I can't it's it's fine, it's cool. Like every now and then it's fine. Like I feel like if you have to take somebody out and spend hundreds of dollars every time then baby go find somebody else. Okay, go find somebody else. Because I feel like that's that's not what it should be about. And that's just my opinion. But yeah, I don't I don't have to be everything don't have to be fancy. And I feel like sometimes when I go to um like hole in the wall spots or like little small bars and stuff like that or whatever it is, that's when I have the best time. I have the time of my life. I'm gonna have fun regardless. But I feel like that's when I have the most fun. So yeah, it don't have to be like everything fancy all the time. I don't want to be bougie all the time. Like, yeah, sometimes I want to go out and, you know, be in that type of environment. And I'm feeling that. But every every time, baby, look, you got to do all that. Because I'm going to have a good old time at this little hole in the wall over here. Okay? And another thing, like, I know some women be, like, when I go to a restaurant, I'm going to eat all my food. 
sir, I'm gonna eat all my food. I don't, I don't care how you feel. I'm gonna eat all my food. I'm not about to sit here and try to be cute. I'm gonna eat my food. And I'm not about to sit here and just gobble my food down and just like, well, damn. Like, I don't, I never eat. But I'm gonna eat all my food. Like, ain't no being cute over here. Even like, I mean, I guess I get it. Like, if you with somebody and y'all on y'all first date of, you know, y'all just getting to know each other, you don't, I, even still, maybe eat your food. Eat your food. Cause guess what? If, if he finds something wrong with that, then you go find him a bird. I'm not about to eat like no damn bird because I'm trying to be cute. No, that's, that's not what we're about to do. So yeah, like, fancy stuff is cool every now and then. And yes, I want you to take me somewhere fancy every now and then. And not because, oh, because I said so on your own terms. Because you want to. Because you feel like, you know, you should. But other than that, baby, let's go to this little hole in the wall. And um, have us a good old night. Okay? That's what, that's what we're going to do. Alright, I'm just talking now. Let me try to finish up. And then I'll come back later. Alright y'all, so I'm almost done. Like I said, I'm not doing no heavy makeup look. And these are the lashes that I'm about to put on. This is High Love. So we we'll see how these work out. And the band is really, really soft. I'm gonna just cut the little, like sometimes they have the little tab. It's sticking out, I'm gonna cut that off. We found the Tokyo a little bit, so. This is it, it's real, real fluffy. Not too thick, not too thin. I think I paid like seven ninety nine for these. So, not too bad. And they're like almost just like the perfect length. They're not too long. They're not too short. I didn't really, I really didn't cut nothing off. I just cut the little extra tab thing off. Sometimes I tune him out so much like I don't even really notice he bought it. Johnny wants to take a shower and I'm in the room so he don't see nobody. And it's like he needs somebody around at all times. Like he has to see somebody. And if not, he go crazy. But he gonna get right. Alright, and that is the lash. I do like it. It's perfect. It's like not too much, not too dramatic, and not too baby girlish. Like some lashes just be like, why you even put lashes on? You could just put mascara on. My mama, my mama wear like little lashes, and I'd be like, I don't want to put this on for you. Let's 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 get something a little bigger than this, you know. Let's each their own. She like her little lashes. Ooh, 9.9. So the idea was to leave at 10. I just can't be on time. I don't understand. What is, what is so hard about it? Alright, now I'm getting blue all over the place. I'm just making a big mess over here. I'm about putting lashes on and doing your brows that I can't do. I can only do one at a time. I can't talk and do my brows. Y'all yeah, know usually I, mean, I have me a little drink when I'm getting ready before I head out. It just start a little early, but tonight we got these little tiny Pepsis, the peep, Peeps Pepsi. So like a uh, um, Easter 
type thing, they limited edition or marshmallow flavor. So, so we're about to try this out. My daughter loves peeps, so we got some for her. We got them from Sam, so let's see what it tastes like. I hate peeps, but these were so cute. All right, Pepsi. All right, peeps. Tastes like cotton candy. Johnny! I'm going to have him to try it. Do y'all do that? Like, every time I try something, I got, he have to try it. Like, taste this? What does it taste like? No, he be like, girl. Like, leave me a phone. But he do the same thing, so. Like, taste this. What do you think it tastes like? I always say that. Put a little bit of blush on it. I don't want to do too, too much. I don't do too much at all. Like I said, this place, I could go in what I have on. I could go, you go, people go in there working on the phone, like after work or whatever. On a Friday, well, today's Saturday, but. All right. Let's go ahead on. I need to uh, film TikTok too. So, I'll be right back. Alright, so the makeup is done. This is pretty much it. Super simple. Nothing too much. Ponytail. I did a, um, uh, little TikTok on this. I didn't do it on YouTube because I already did. I pretty much did it in the last vlog I posted for, um, the Mardi Gras video. I posted the last one. That was the last one I posted, so I didn't do it again, and I really didn't have time, so... We don't need to get dressed because it's just 9.54, so I'm going to show you what I'm going to put on. All right, so I think I'm just wearing some some mom jeans, like they have no rips in them. Mom jeans. Um, this shirt. And the bag match good with it, so... We'll do that and just some regular nude um, heels. Nothing too much, nothing too much jeans and shirts at the night. I told this man I was going to be working at 10. I lied. I think he might be lying. I am not really be lying at the time. Be trying to be ready at that time, but. It'll be at clearly. Happy Sunday, y'all. So it is the next day. 
We had a good time last night. I showed y'all a few clips of the spot we went to and French. So we went on Frenchman Street. So I tried to put, I didn't bring my camera. So I did a few, a few things on my phone. So I showed y'all like Frenchman Street, like what goes on on Frenchman Street. And I showed y'all the little spot we went to. We had a good time. Like I said, we, um, it's not new to us. We always go down there because like Frenchman is a good time. It's not, if y'all familiar with Bourbon Street, it's like a adult more upscale bourbon street and they have like different little spots you can go in and out of like jazz music we went to one of the jazz spots we usually go to that was a night you know it's really nice um they had a lot of people down there so it was like our usual something we usually do something we like doing i love frenchman street like i said it's an upgraded more adult version of bourbon street so it's like it's always something going on down there it's always a bunch of people a good time um People could just kind of like freestyling. Like people are really talented down on Frenchman. I would guess, I think they make a lot of money down there doing what they do, so it's a good time. So now it's Sunday and it's, it's almost 11 o'clock, it's 10.52. So we got up later than expected. I wanted to get up at like 7.30, no later than eight o'clock, but it was like 9.30 by the time we got up, which is cool, I guess, you know, but whatever. So I'm headed to Walmart right now because I'm going to get some stuff. Like I always go to the stores on Sunday to get what we need for the week for the house to cook. Like for Nala, school for her to take to lunch or whatever. So I'm headed to do that. I don't have to get a whole bunch of stuff because we went to Sam's yesterday. Like I showed y'all we went to Sam's and we did pick up a few things. So I don't have a whole bunch of stuff on the list. But I am cooking today and I want to cook like a real Sunday meal today. Because it's been a minute. I used to cook like a real Sunday meal every Sunday but it's been a minute like I said it's, it's been a little hectic so um I'm going to the store and pick that up I think I'm gonna cook some turkey wings some baked mac and cheese um I don't know what else but for the most part that's what we're gonna have today so I'm about to head out to the store and get that do some of my little Sunday errands I'm not gonna stay out as long as I usually do today because like I said I gotta lay start on everything so I'm gonna try to make it back in time to clean up do house chores and start dinner so Let's roll, y'all. So I'm just making it to Walmart, about to get outside. For some, some, something told me to log on to my TikTok. I'm not really big on TikTok because I don't know why. Um, I post on there every now and then, not like really often. Most of the times, I post what I post on Instagram on my TikTok. But I just noticed I was wondering, like, why the hell am I getting all these notifications? One of the videos I posted just went viral. But let me tell y'all something. That video was a video that I wasn't gonna post. I was like. Nobody not gonna see this. Like I'm not gonna post this. And that's the one that that I think it was 300 and K 301 um, thousand views or whatever. None of my videos have ever reached 301 thousand views. So that was really good. But and yes, I'm a little you know I'm a little psyched. But um, I said that to say like post the shit, post it. If you recorded it, if you thought about recording it, obviously at some point something something in your brain told you or somewhere along the lines you felt like it was good enough to record so post it post it don't it don't matter and sometimes I'm really um I have to, I go back and forth with myself like I'll record a whole video a whole vlog sometimes I'll be like you know what I'm not about to edit this shit I'm about to post this something one of the videos I actually edited and I wasn't gonna post it and I was like you know what this I'm like it took me I don't know how long to walk. It's, it's vlogging is not easy, y'all. You walking around with a big ass camera, not even a big ass camera, because my camera is pretty small. It's lightweight. You walking around with a camera in your, camera in your face, people looking at you crazy. Um, sometimes it can be uncomfortable, but it's what you're doing. Like if you feel like if you headed to like if you want to be, and I'm not going to even say if you want to be. You are a YouTuber, so you have to act like a YouTuber. You are a content creator. You have to act like a content creator. So you cannot be um afraid or embarrassed to go out and record and sometimes it's very uncomfortable like right now somebody is looking at me in a car because my windows are intended as y'all can see um looking at me talking to a camera but I, hey, what you want me to do i don't come to your job and look at you while you work or whatever you do so it's just kind of like you have to ignore that shit and just know that you're doing this for a reason because you love doing it because this is your job whatever that reason is because you're working towards a goal do it post that shit all right y'all my camera's about to die in a few so i'm gonna go walk in walmart i may or may not record because my camera's about all right y'all so i'm in walmart and it's very very noisy in here for whatever reason and my basket is kind of noisy so i'm gonna go in there and see what's going on i just came here to get a few things so i should be that long why you made a war that was fighting now and you fall and you run when you see my big Guns run around, run away as the rebel comes out. There you go, call on me. 
When you call me, I come, but then you go again. With your death, yeah, open your mind to the sound of the trumpet. What do you want from the night for the whole Now, yeah, you want to beg in the ground. I want to fly, yeah, I'm trying to move. Running away to the land of the sun. Running away from the sun. What's up, y'all? I just got back from Walmart. It's 2 03. My camera died in a car after I left Walmart, so I couldn't record the rest of it, but I was just running around trying to find turkey necks, I mean turkey wings, because Walmart didn't have none. And I ain't gonna show y'all what I got today because I didn't get a whole bunch of stuff. Because we still had stuff left from last week, from when I uh, showed y'all I went to Trader Joe's, and I told y'all too we went to Sam yesterday, so we have meat and all that stuff. The only thing I got was like Nala um, stuff for lunch and the stuff that I'm gonna cook today and like a few other things. So I'm cooking turkey wings, um, macaroni and cheese, maybe some greens if I have time. I got the greens, but I don't know if I'm cooking them. I might start cooking them right now and I can just leave them on and finish doing what I need to do. Cause I still gotta go get Nala, I still gotta clean up, still gotta wash clothes, still gotta do everything, so. I don't know about the green, but I might just put them on there. Do you like these? Uh, they like cut up in pieces. So usually I get the whole, like the whole turkey wing, but nobody had them. I went to Rouse's, I went to Walmart, and nobody had them, so I got, I went to two Walmart. So I got like these, um, it's turkey wings, but they cut up in pieces. I don't know. I don't think I ever cooked those before, but I'm sure it's the same thing. Um, so that's it. I'm gonna put these groceries up. And I might go get Nala or I might put the food on and then leave the food on while I go get her and then come back and finish cooking, clean up, I don't know. I told y'all last time I was trying to, I be trying to put myself on like a, a schedule, but stuff don't go as planned because this morning I was supposed to, my plan was to get up at like seven o'clock or 7.30. That ain't happened because y'all seen me went out last night, which I don't think that's the reason. I probably was tired, I don't know, but I didn't get up at 7.30. We didn't get up till like 9.30, 8.30, something like that, I don't know, 9.30 maybe? Yeah, 9.30, so that put me behind already for what I needed to do. I want to get up, um, go to Walmart, get the stuff, come back home, clean up, put the food on while I was cleaning up, but that didn't happen, so it usually don't happen like that every weekend, but I be trying to give myself, I be trying to give myself like one off day, and I try to make that be Saturday, but that don't happen either because when I'm in here and I'm supposed to be off from doing shit, I, I be wanting to clean up and then I do I'm, I be battling myself on like okay you've been working the whole week I want to do something fun I want to enjoy myself so it be like all right either you do something fun enjoy yourself and catch up on rest do housework and it's like either either one you choose some shit still ain't gonna get done and you still gotta do that so it's just like ain't no off days you just gotta do what you gotta do so anyway I'm about to put this stuff up there. But you knew that already When I found you on the ground You were dying Now you call me to my yard On the vat Can you see me on the edge I'm in art If the world was then Would you cry Or would you try to get me Tell me now Understand, can you tell me now why you made a war that was fighting now? And you fall and you run when you see 
my big guns Run around, run away As the rebel comes out Then you go, call on me When you call me, I come But then you go again With your deaf ears Open your mind to the sound of the trumpet What do you want from me? Good morning, y'all. So it is the next day. Today is Monday and it is 11:34. So I was supposed to hop back on last night at the um I told you I was cooking, I was cleaning up. Um I was just trying to do like Sunday chores. I was trying to get everything done. I did not get everything done. I was so goddamn tired last night. I was supposed to do the unboxing for y'all and um do I was supposed to film a TikTok video while I did the unboxing or at least show y'all how I film my TikTok videos and I was so tired. I couldn't do a goddamn. As y'all can see the I was washing the sofa covers and everything. Everything is still well. Actually, I washed one half last night. I washed half of the um, sofa covers last night. So it's slip covers, y'all, and those are so hard to wash. So you have to take off the whole, pretty much undo the whole sofa. Um, they're really big, so you can only really do one part at a time. So I got one half of the sofa washed, and I put those uh, slip covers back on. And this morning, once everybody left, because it's easy for me to do stuff when everybody gone, I put the other half in the washing machine. So, well, actually, I just put them in the dryer. So, they dry now. So, after that's dry, I'll put them back on. So, this was supposed to be just the weekend thing, vlog, just for the weekend. And I was supposed to end it yesterday, but I did not have back on. I didn't finish doing everything I needed to do that I wanted to do on this vlog. So, it's extended until today. Today is Monday. Um, So, I was just setting up to do, to film my TikTok unboxing because I'm doing, I got some stuff from Amazon that I wanted to do. I'm sorry, my Amazon unboxing. I got some stuff from Amazon to kind of like, not redo the desk in a room, but just add some little items to it that'll make it uh, everything easy to use. So I got like a um, phone holder because sometimes when I'm on computer editing videos, I want to watch videos on my phone in between or while I'm editing. Um, I got a riser for the keyboard. I got some a few little things just to like make using that area easier. So I'm in, I am in my little um, dressing room, so I'm going to film it in here just because it's, it's much brighter in here. Um, and I have like this little section right here I can film, it's really, really bright. I'm going to use my ring light and I'm going to show you how I record it. And then, so the desk is in our room, so I'm going to bring everything to the room and then I'll put everything together and I'll show you all that as well. So this is where I'll be recording the video at in this little section right here. I have everything set up. This is the stool I'm going to sit in. I have my phone camera, my phone on a tripod, and I have the ring light off, kind of like to the side. So, this is what I will be recording. All right, so now that I got the, that's the first part of the video I got recorded, and it's gonna be an ASMR video, so um, you wanna make as much noise as possible with opening the packages. So I'm gonna move on to the bedroom where the computer is and do the second part of the video where I set everything up. Kind of do like a before and after and set everything up. So this is the um, computer space I was talking about. 
sorry if this in your way this is a light i didn't feel like burning that big old ring light in here so i'm gonna use the small one and i am over here with my phone and my tripod and i'm gonna catch the angle for um for the tiktok from this side and i really will probably have these wires out of them, but they're just how they made so I'm just catching like a before shot before I put everything on. When I found you on the ground, you were dying. Now you call me to my yard, uninvited. Can you see me on the edge? I'm in naughty. If the world was in, would you cry or would you try to get me? Tell me now, I want you to be clear. Yeah. Tell me now, I need you to be clear. Yeah. I will wait for you, for you. I will wait for you. I will wait for you. Gabby, can you put the time on a rewind? Help me understand, can you tell me now Why you made a war that we're fighting now And you fall and you run When you see my big guns run around So I finished the video, I don't know why I'm uh, this light on top I have a light on top of the camera, it keep dying Really, really fast, I don't know Maybe something wrong with the charger or the battery But this is the finished look I just added this little clear acrylic um, keyboard stand type thing. It makes the keyboard like kind of go on the slant where it's easy to, for you to type. This is the rose gold phone holder I was telling y'all about. And this mat because that mouse pad sometimes the mouse pad is just not big enough for me to scroll or scroll down. So sometimes I have to like keep putting the mouse pad, the mouse back on top of the pad and it just takes too much time. So with this I can like, I have room to scroll all over. And that should make it a lot easier for when I'm editing videos. So yeah, I hope y'all really enjoyed this video. Everything that I use for the computer desk will be linked down below in my description box. It'll be on my Amazon storefront. Um, I also have a link on my YouTube that links you to my Amazon storefront. So if you want to click on it to purchase any of these things, it will be mentioned in the description box. And I really hope y'all enjoyed this video. I will see y'all next time.